Hello, YouTubers. Um, so today I wanted to talk to you about uh, a show that I recently discovered on the instant Netflix. Um, it's one that's been on TV for for a while, and I'd heard of it. I just never got a chance to actually check it out, and I finally um, decided to give it a try on the instant Netflix. Um, the show I am talking about is called How I Met Your Mother. Uh, I had been thinking of giving it a try for a long time, finally got around uh, not too long ago to, to starting. And um, I really like the show. I really fell in love with it. it it's great. Um, it's it's hilarious. It's funny. It's goofy. It's just a it's a really great show. So um, basically, it, it um, the main character Ted Mosby, architect. Um, it's sort of it's told as a um, older, a more adult Ted. It's told through him telling his children the story of how that how he met their mother. Um, of course, he never gets to it, that that part of it to actually meeting their mother, um, you know, because you know obviously if they, if he did, what would be left of the show? So um, he he tells them like various stories throughout his younger life, um, in like his late twenties, um, you know, of which he he says basically all of it leads up to how you know how he met their mother. Um, so anyway, uh, the main character, like I said, is Ted Mosby. Um, he also, he lives in, um, an apartment with his, uh, best friend Marshall, um, and Marshall's, uh, fiancé and, uh, later wife, um, Lily. Um, Marshall's played by Jason Siegel, who I've always been a huge fan of, so, uh, excuse me, so, you know, him being in this, that was to me a, a, a big selling point. I've always been a big fan of his and a big fan of his movies and, and, and stuff. Another important character, one of the main characters, is Robin. Um, he starts as a he. She starts as a, a love interest for Ted. Um, you know they they kind of meet and he kind of gets smitten with her. Um, later on, they kind of don't don't work out. I, I don't want to spoil too much of of the story for you, but I'm not spoiling a huge part of it for you here. But um. Kind of basically the reason they sort of don't work as a couple, even though, you know, a couple of times they try, uh, is because Ted is looking for a serious relationship. You know, he really, he really wants to find the one. Um, whereas Robin sort of is just, is not looking for that. She's not looking to settle down, down any time in the near future. She's, um, she's kind of a career woman. She's, uh, she's a news anchor and she kind of is tied up in that and she doesn't, you know, she, she doesn't see herself anytime soon getting married, having kids, that kind of stuff. Um, so, you know, they kind of try it a couple times, but they sort of don't work out. Um, Lily and Marshall are, are like everybody's, you know, perfect couple. They're like the, you know, the couple that, um, you know, everybody just thinks was like made for each other. Um, and then, of course, uh, last but not least, you've got Barney. Now, Barney is played by Neil Patrick Harris, who I've been a huge fan of since his Doogie Howser days. Uh, and Barney is basically like a a womanizer like in, in in he's just hilarious the guy is just great he's funny but um he's also kind of a sleaze ball um but he's you know he's also a good guy like he really you know he really um he means well in his own way i guess you could say uh, but he's just such a hilarious character he's like one of the he really makes the show um so he's always you know he's always trying to he's always trying to score women and to help ted score women um, I, I, I don't know. I just can't say enough thing, great things about this show. I, I, I'm kind of sorry. I re resisted watching it for so long. It's awesome show. Um, another kind of funny thing is, you know, um, with my situation, you know, I've kind of talked about it a little bit. Um, so, you know, I've started to thinking if, if, and when somewhere, you know, down the road, I, I start to, um, get out in the dating world again. Um, I kind of started to think about like, you know, inevitably, what kind of a, what kind of, you know, what do I want out of a relationship? What kind of a relationship do I want? The funny thing is I started to think, you know something? I want to be Marshall and Lily. <laughs> I want to be like that, that goofy couple, that inseparable couple that, you know, people just think we're made for each other. 
and you know i mean and and as much as you know on the show that's like they 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 hate to be apart they're like the same they're like one person connected together um but they still sometimes you know they'll like you know lily will hang out with robin you know or uh marshall will hang out with barney and ted and, and the guys um so it's you know it's not like they absolutely can't be separated but they're like they they're just made for each other they like belong together <laughs> so i just thought that was kind of funny that's like some, sort of you know one of the things i was thinking like that's that's kind of what i would want in a relationship um but anyway, like I said, you know, I can't rave enough about this show. It's been on, I think, something like eight seasons. And I, I think it might still, I, I believe it's actually still on for a ninth season, which I, I think I've heard is just going to be the final season. So uh, I absolutely fell in love with this show. So um, hopefully I'm not jinxing myself. So far, I'm only up to, I think, like season four or five um, on the instant Netflix. But um, I just absolutely love the show. So, you know, if you haven't checked it out, I, I absolutely recommend you do check it out. It's on, like I said, in Netflix. That's how I've kind of been catching up with it. All right, YouTubers, have a nice day.